Hey, what's up YouTube and welcome back to the Custom Adventures. So today we're going to be reviewing the League Smartwatch. Let's get into it. Alright, so starting off we have their little logo here and on the sides it just says smartwatch and on the back it just gives us all the features that the watch actually has now just opening up the case gives you a nice little pull out with that plastic tab and here we go so it looks like we have a watch a charging cord and then the instruction manual pulling those out all right first impressions with the watch it's not bad Looks pretty nice, looks fairly similar to other models we've reviewed, but overall looks pretty cool. And then of course, the USB Type-C charging cable. All right, so now in order to connect the app, we have to uh, download uh, this, this app. So we're just gonna scan the QR code real fast. Go ahead and click on that. And this presumably will take us to the App Store where we can download their app. Get on Apple App Store. And yeah, so I just gotta do that real fast. All right, and now while that's downloading, we'll get the, you know, just the initial impressions of the watch. So first, we're just gonna like turn it on here. Let's see, can we scroll? Oh yeah, we can scroll so we can see we have a bunch of different faces. This is, this is pretty similar to the fake Apple Watch that we just reviewed, where they just have, have different faces. Can you see if we can interact with them? Doesn't appear that we can do that, but that's still pretty cool. So here we've got the app, it gives you exercise record, step count. It, it gives you like, I guess a map for running and stuff. Aw, oh, sick. China, Beijing, gnarly. Unit setting, you can do Imperial metric, Celsius to Fahrenheit. You can connect it to Apple Health. And then you can just add your personal information and yeah, you can set a step goal. Let's go to the max, 20,000, yeah. You just gotta click on add device on the app. Okay, probably the QW33 then. All right, it is now connected. And it'll also show you your heart rate, your sleep, your beats per minute, your body odor. Oh wait, no, it's, that's oxygen, <laughs> BO, <laughs> nice. And then apparently it's supposed to be able to measure your stress. Interesting. All right, cool. So that, that's all we need for the phone. So I think if we want to get to the outside, yeah, we just have to swipe down, which is interesting. And we have our beats per minute. Let's do a quick test, because, you know, we've had great success with these in the past. Let's do a quick test on how accurate this reading will actually be. So just, I'll just leave it on for just a sec and we'll see what happens. Okay, so it says I have 71 beats per minute. Oh, it keeps dropping. Okay, now we're... Okay, that's interesting. Okay, now we're, now we're at 67. Started 71, got 67. Now what we're gonna do is we are going to test it on an inanimate object. Let's go on ahead with this fancy dancy camera lens here. Let's, let's see, let's see if it'll pass the test of stupidity. I know there's a chance that it might never just read it. We'll be here, I'll, I'll stay for like, I'll wait for like two minutes just to make sure, but it probably won't give us like, oh, there's no heartbeat here. It's just, it just won't give us a reading. In that case, this thing actually semi works. I'm not sure how accurate it is, but at least it works. Later. Okay, it does se doesn't seem to be working, so, this thing passed the test. It's not totally stupid. Well done. Congratulations. Congratulations. Well done. All right, let's see. I'm, I'm, I want to see if, what we got in settings here. We have card MGT. I have no idea what that is. Um, find phone. So we, we can ping the phone. Let's see. Let's get the phone here. It does in fact ping the phone. That's interesting. That's a cool feature. Okay, sick. So it's, it's, it's like an Apple Watch. You, you can ping your phone. That's awesome, actually. 
Sedentary. Okay, this is probably like the stand stand timer or whatever. Uh, let's see what else we got in here. We can switch up the language. Menu list. What's this? Stew. Style list. What's what's that? Okay. Oh, I see what this does. So it just makes it a list instead of like you know the Apple Watch design where they're all little icons checked together. I actually, actually like the icons a little more so let's go on ahead and switch that back okay is there anything else on this watch that's really interesting um, I'm not seeing a whole lot ooh the O2 test is the O2 thing fake that will be the greatest question of all because apparently it is now measuring the camera ah ah Okay, okay, well done. This thing's 30 bucks, and it I think all of these actually work. That's actually very well done. That's that's genuinely impressive. Congratulations! Congratulations! I don't know, there's, there's not much else to say. Ooh, we have free Apple music. I'm assuming it'll probably just play it on the phone. Yeah, no, it, it's, it's just start playing music on the phone. Dang it. Okay, and I think the last feature we're gonna check out here is the camera. I'm assuming we get the camera in here. Shebang. How do we do this? No, nothing? Okay, so the camera doesn't work. That's a little disappointing. Other than that, sick watch. 30 bucks. I'll check the link down below if you want if you guys want to check it out. It's pretty solid. And I know that's that's about it. So yeah, you know, have a good rest of your day. If you would like to check this out, the link will be in the description below, as well as our merch. And you know, if you want to email me, you got products, you got ideas for the channel, our email will be down below. And yeah, that's about it. Make sure to like and subscribe, and peace.